Oh yeah guys, Bloomin' Friends here. Do, um, before I start, I do apologise about the camera going, I guess, the same again. I'm in the same spot as the last video, but in this video, I'm going to be talking about these, these gloves. These are the mechanic gloves everybody keeps telling, everybody was telling everybody to get. So, this is my views on these gloves. It's nothing against anybody else. I am not being horrible against anybody else, but this is just my opinion. Right, to start off with, I do like them, but at the same time, I don't like them. Yeah? What I like about them, yes, they do protect your hands when you're doing wood. Yes, they do protect your hands when you're doing all that type of stuff. But they're not fire resistant. Everybody was saying at one point these were fire resistant gloves. They're not. Right, sorry about this, guys. I've got to just go do that. They're not. I've burnt myself three or four times by wearing these gloves. I burnt myself today by using these gloves. The thing I don't understand how people are about these gloves are these little holes in the fingers. That's something I don't understand, but a hole. Yeah. Um, I put some power cord on them on the the actual. Um, what do you call them? Tabs, the name tag, tag thing, type thing. So then I can hang these off my EDC wood kit. So I'm just gonna keep it on Dopey Dog. He's running around with a friggin' log. Uh, so yeah, um, these are medium. They do fit nice and snug. As you can see, they fit nice and snug. They are good. They are comfortable. But there's only one slight problem with them. And this is what everybody was saying before I bought these. Saying that they're fire resistant. They're not. I'm going to find it now. There. I don't know if you can see that. That's a barn from today. That's what happened today. Just by taking off my coffee. Sorry, I'm going to have a sip. Oh, I can't it again. No more. I'm not really used. Nope, you're going to leave me. There we go. So, yeah, I have uh, taxed the carabiner onto that. I was just going to use a carabiner on these two loop, on these two pieces, but they didn't. It didn't work comfortable. So, yeah. So now I'm looking for an all round pair of gloves. Again. I need an all round pair. I need an all round pair. It needs to do the woodcraft. It needs to fit comfortably in my hand. Um, it needs to take things off the stove. At this moment in time, I'm using the bandana to do that. I don't mind using this, don't get me wrong, but I prefer to use a pair of gloves. Sorry, guys, I just want to do that again. I prefer to use a pair of gloves, but find out these are not fire resistant. I know you can fire, buy fire resistant spray, but I don't want to use fire resistant spray on a pair of gloves, I guess. I'd rather just go out and buy a nice pair of gloves, a decent set of pair of gloves. These weren't cheap, neither. These were about 15, 16, about 15, 20 pounds, something like that. I think I remember rightly, or maybe a bit more. I don't know, I have to leave the um, price at the bottom of this page. Um, as you can see, I can't really look how much it's cost me, because I'm in the middle of the woods. And yes, I do have internet on my phone, but I'm not looking now. So, yeah, it's... They are good, they are comfortable, they are good to have. And they are handy, don't get me wrong. And they are super lightweight as well. That's another thing I like about them. The only thing I don't like about them is that they're not fire resistant. Like everybody said they're fire resistant, they're not. They're nowhere near. So, yeah. Right, I'm going to leave it here, guys. That's what I'm going to say about the gloves. I do sound, I don't know, that sounds a bit of a rant. I do apologise about that. But yeah, if you're going to buy them, just remember they're not fire resistant. They're fantastic for doing everything else. They're just not fire resistant. Okay, right. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for all your support. Thank you for all your comments and your views. And um, please stay safe and well. And thank you for all your time as well. And thank you for all the new subs and all my old subs as well. Thank you. Goodbye.